what is going on guys welcome back to the channel film study for rookies today man we're going to break down chiefs rookie receiver rasheed rice i gotta tell you that might be patrick mahomes new second favorite weapon obviously behind travis kelsey because you can see the game plan has been built around him versus the bills the dolphins and the ravens let's jump into the film so i can show you guys a little bit more about what i'm talking about all right guys now we're in the film room the first play we're going to look at isn't a highlight but it's to show you guys why they did what they did with Rasheed Rice. Take a look right here. Ravens, two high safeties. They're like, we don't want to get beat over the top. You could argue PI there, but the whole point of this video is to talk about why Rasheed Rice was used the way he did. Let's jump to the next play. So the next play we're going to look at, you can see you got Kelsey going in motion. They're going to run the RPO, bam, a little bubble screen, kick it out to Rasheed Rice, and he almost gets 15 yards on this bubble screen. Let's run this back real quick. So as we run this play back, you got Travis Kelsey going in motion. Anytime he goes in motion anywhere, the defense is going to follow of some sort, right? This time, Patrick Queen's going to come up. So that's one thing to watch, right? We're going to let the play develop. We're going to pause it right about here. Bam. So Queen's now focused over here with Kelsey. You're going to hold the linebacker here, which is huge. Because when they run the screen, Rice is going to catch it right here, right? Take a look what happens. Bam, he catches it. Since you held the linebacker right here, take a look. Since you hold him right here, that allows offensive line to get out. Bam. Get in front of him, right? Boom. Boom. He catches it off of the line, picks up that linebacker, and there goes Rasheed Rice. Great play by the Chiefs right here. Take a look at this one more time. Like I said before, Kelsey goes in motion. They run the RPO. Hold both backers right here. Allow the lineman time to pull out. Then bam. Good stuff right there. Key block by the receiver too. Let's keep it going. All right, guys. The next play we're going to look at. Ravens, once again, two high safeties. You got Pacheco going in motion. Mahomes does a great job reading the nickel back. Let's run this play back real quick. So like I've said previously, Ravens, two high safeties, right? Bang, bang. Could be cover two, maybe cover two man. But as the play develops, we're going to see the Ravens go into a cover three. So Hamilton's actually going to come up. He's going to play this zone. This defender right here has that zone. Bang, and then bang, right? So who is Mahomes reading? He's reading the nickel back, right? Let's run this play back real quick. He's reading this guy right here. Does he go with Pacheco or does he pick up Rice right here? Well, here's the thing with Rice. Rice actually does a block and release right here. Take a look what happens. We're going to pause it right about here. Bam. A little block and release. What's going to happen is this nickelback right here doesn't notice Rice right here immediately. So what's he do? He drifts out towards Pacheco. Mahomes does a great job looking up the defender and then bam, hits Rice right there. Good stuff. Let's keep this thing going. All right, guys. Right here, it's third down for the Chiefs. They need a first down, right? You're going to see the motion Pacheco from the left to the right. That's a big move right there. It actually allows Rice to be open. Let's break down how this happened. On top of that, great route by Rice, but how did this happen, right? Well, take a look. At the beginning of this play, we see man-to-man -man coverage, probably cover one, right? Man-to-man -man across the board, as you see. So if that's the case, most likely this linebacker right here, he's going to pick up Pacheco. Now, why does that matter? Well, the only person not picking anybody up is this linebacker right here. When Rasheed Rice runs this drag route, this linebacker could easily sit right there on that and Mahomes wouldn't be able to hit him. So what happens right here? When they move Pacheco over, this linebacker now picks up Pacheco. It looks like this linebacker right here is going to sit in the spy. Well, he's not going to travel with Rice. If he does, all this space right here is going to be open for Mahomes, right? So take a look what happens right here. We're going to let the play develop. We're going to pause it right about here. Like I said before, this linebacker is going to sit there with Rice, but he's not going to travel with him, right? Take a look what happens. Bang. He tries to get in Rice's way, throw him off, but Kelsey does a great job because they're going to run a mesh concept right here. Bang, bang, right? So as you're going to see right here, you got Kelsey and Rice running that mesh concept. We're going to pause it right here. Bang. Kelsey's going to get in front of that defender. That's going to create enough separation for Rice to get open. Good stuff right there. Let's jump to the next play. All right, guys. So we saw how the Chiefs attacked the Ravens. This time it's against the Bills. It's actually a similar concept. Watch what happens right here. The Bills get pressure on Mahomes. Rice does a great job staying in that open spot, and he gets a first down. A lot of yards after catch two. Let's run this back real quick. So as we take another look at this play, you got Kelsey going to motion, right? He's essentially going to run a speed out. Take a look what happens. Once the ball snaps, Kelsey goes up, then bam, cuts that thing out. Now this is interesting because you got Rice right here. You have a corner route right here, right? Let the play develop. You got three guys essentially in the same area. But because it's Kelsey, this defender is actually going to stick with them. You don't want to leave Kelsey open, right? So what happens next? Kelsey's going to take his defender upfield. Rasheed Rice does a great job finding the open spot and sitting there. 
He doesn't try and do too much, go up here, right? He sits there, waits for Mahomes to find him. Good stuff right there because you're going to see it again. Let's jump to the next play. All right, guys, right here, it's a little bit different. Empty backfield set. you got Mahomes doing a 360 as the ball is being snapped, man. Let's run this play back. There's a lot to look at right here. So as we run this play back, the first thing I notice is obviously Mahomes spinning as the ball is being snapped. Now, I'm guessing he's doing this so the defenders potentially don't rush to the ball, right? you got the guard right here who's going to push out and try and get second level. So if he can make the defenders look over here for a second, allows his lineman more time to basically get to that second level, right? So take a look what happens. Once the ball is snapped, this linebacker really doesn't bite on that because the second he sees Hardman pushing this way, he's automatically reacting, right? So take a look what happens. Bang, bang. He's reacting. The guard does a great job getting to second level. Rice is going to get at the 15, and then watch what happens next. Bam, 10, 5. Woo, big play right there down to the four-yard line. Rice is doing everything. The offense looks good. Let's keep it going. All right, guys, we've seen what they've done against the Bills. We've seen what they've done against the Ravens. Now let's look what happened against the Dolphins. This time it's a little bit different on how they use Rice and really the offensive game plan. Let's run this play back real quick so I can show you guys what I'm talking about. So as we run this play back, the first person to focus on is Kelsey, right? They're going to run a mesh concept. Kelsey goes on top. Once again, Rice goes below. We've seen this before, right? But here's the thing. This Dolphins defender who's picking up Rice I'm pretty sure he thought they were playing match coverage, which means if they're playing match, he picks up Kelsey right there. This defender lets go of Kelsey, and he picks up Rice, right? Well, take a look what happens. Rice is going to be wide open. Now, when I say they're on the mesh concept, usually Kelsey would go up here, basically rub this defender, create a little bit of separation for Rice. But as you're going to see, this defender stops following Rice. So what's going to happen? Rice is going to be wide open. Take a look. Bang, bang, good stuff right there. Let's keep it going. All right, guys, on this play right here, this showed me that Mahomes and Rice, they really have that chemistry. Rice does a great job on top of that, stopping on his route. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about real quick. So I believe Rice was basically going to run across there. Bam, he's got a receiver over the top who's probably going to go deeper, right? But take a look what happens. As you're going to see, this defensive back right here is going to drop back. He's going to play Rice. If Rice were to keep running this way, this defensive back could play both, right? So Rice is going to stop. What happens next? 21's actually going to go with this receiver. So then watch what Mahomes sees, right? He sees Rice shift over this way. 21's going to drop back. Nobody is going to be in this area, right? He's picking up him. He's got him. This defender doesn't see Rice behind him. Take a look what happens next. Bam. Mahomes finds his second favorite weapon, like I said before, right? All right, guys, on this next play, once again, Chiefs go back to that mesh concept, and it works. Dolphins playing that man-to-man -man coverage. Justin does a great job giving Rice a little bit more separation. Take a look right here. So as we take another look at this play, we're going to pause it right about here. As you can see, Justin sees this defender chasing Rice. So what's he do? He tries to force this defender over here. Now, he doesn't completely succeed, but he at least gives Rice enough separation to catch it and keep running, right? Take a look what happens. This defender can still come down pretty good, but Justin forces him to wait an extra second or two. Good stuff right there, man. Let's jump to our last play. All right, guys, right here is going to be our final play. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Let me know what your favorite play has been. We're going to let this run. Break it down after. How does Rice get so open? What a throw. Let's take one more look at this. So as we take a look at this play and figure out how Rice got so open, the first thing to note is Watson going in motion, right? Take a look what happens to the defense right here, all right? Watson goes in motion. Safety is going to come down. That tells Mahomes most likely man-to-man -man coverage. Nobody is going to be deep, right? So watch what happens next. He's got a couple favorable matchups. You've got Kelsey one-on-one -on -one right here. You've got Harbin with the safety, or you have Rice with a ton of separation, right? So take a look at what happens. Harbin's going to push the safety back right here, and then Rice is going to have so much room because there's going to be nobody around him. Great cut by Rice. Good throw by Mahomes getting hit too. Bam. That's going to wrap it up. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Stay tuned. More content coming soon. On top of that, let me know what you guys want to see in the future. I'll catch you guys in the next one.